Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Obviously things have changed and I have been uploaded in like three weeks and I just want to say my bad about that um, College has been tearing me up man. Not gonna lie, but while going to school, of course I still have been buying manga So I just want to go ahead and show you what I got to start off the month of February So let's jump into it. So the first volume that I was able to pick up for February is actually a omnibus and that omnibus is volume seven and eight of blue giant now if you haven't been reading blue giant what are you doing bro if you like music if you like to make music or like to listen to music this manga is for you bro and another thing that i noticed about the covers is that the further in the story you get i don't know if y'all can see that the members of the band grows longer and longer as you go through the story so um in this newest volume we've got die the main character on the saxophone we've got sawabi on the piano and we've got a new member on the drums so i'm kind of hyped to see how that fans out i love this manga so much bro it's it's mad good like, y'all gotta jump into it while you can i'm telling you the next volume that i was able to pick up is volume nine of chainsaw man now i've already read this volume on the shonen jump app um early not necessarily early but i read it before the volume dropped so i already know what happens in this volume i've already read all of its contents but i had to pick it up just so that way i can have all of chainsaw man if you haven't been able to read chainsaw man i highly recommend the app just because it's so hard to get your hands on these volumes it's gotten a little bit better over time but those volume ones volume twos those ones are still really hard to find so if you can't find it physical just read it on the app it's 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 really good the next volume i was able to get is volume one of asadora now i don't know anything about this manga whatsoever all i know is that it is highly renowned a lot of people like it a whole lot people say that this is like in their top 10 and i don't have a clue what it's about i thought it was about planes because i saw a plane on one of the volumes but apparently it's about a young girl and she's trying to basically make it when her um her town is attacked by kaiju which is you know monsters so i found out found that was pretty interesting and um, i figured i'll scoop it up and check it out now these volumes are 15 dollars a piece where i live so i don't know if i'm gonna get all these at once but i'll definitely you know if i like the first volume i'll chip away at it get it here and there but I'm not getting it all at once because that extra five dollars than normal would be punching my pockets with maximum efficiency. Next volume I was able to get, I was actually mad hyped to find this, um, and that is Hell's Paradise Volume 2. Now, for a manga that only has 13 volumes, this is really hard to find where I'm at um, here in Texas. Luckily, I was able to scoop up volume two, so that way I can actually start the story and everything, get things started out after volume one, of course. Um, I wanna say the 13th volume of this just dropped recently. So if you're able to get that, that's pretty cool. You can actually finish the story and everything, find out how it ends. Um, definitely not for kids, but I highly do recommend if you're not, if you're not scared from a little blood and gore, then you'll be fine. These next volumes, I'm not sure if I was able to show you these in other videos or not, it's been a while, so I kind of forgot what I've shown y'all and what I haven't. But just in case, I'm going to show y'all all four of them. And that is the first four volumes of Comey Can't Communicate. Now, as you can see, my bookmark is in here. And it's not very far in there, but it's there. And I am so far rocking with this manga, bro. As you can see, I already have the first four volumes. Comey Can't Communicate is just different, bro. It's so good. I don't know what it is. The art style, fire. The story, fire. Characters, fire. If you're sleeping on Comey Can't Communicate, 
you gotta wake up dog the next volume i was able to pick up is actually a new release and that is undead unluck volume 5. now undead unluck is a shonen jump title um that's like fresh out the gate only five volumes in it is it's really good to me so far i think i'm three and a half volumes in the story so far but i am keeping up with getting the volumes as they come out um because they're maybe coming out pretty quick i want to say volume four came out november 2021 and volume five came out january of 2022 so that's a month in between volumes so that that's fairly quick if you know how slow manga comes out nowadays um i highly do recommend undead unluck if you're into just like a comedy shonen this next volume i had to get when i saw this in the wild bro at my books in a million it wasn't on amazon it wasn't on right stuff it is nowhere to be found until i walked into the store and saw one left just chilling there and that is hunter x hunter volume four bruh now i have volumes one and two i can't find three but um i'm starting to collect hunter hunter um just like through the bits and pieces that i do find Usually when I go to different places, they have like volume 40, volume 34, or stuff like that. They don't have like the first 10 ever. So I'm trying to collect as much Hunter Hunter as I can. So that way I can read it, you know what I'm saying? Wish me luck on trying to find the rest of these because it's gonna be borderline impossible. But I'ma try anyways. Last but not least, this volume, I was not expecting to get. I was on my little lunch break, you know what I'm saying? Going to the books a million just to look around and see what they had. And I was able to find Haiku Volume 1. Now, last time I checked, Haiku is like really hard to find, at least for me. Um, they only have the higher ending volumes from where I'm at. Um, so whenever I saw Volume 1, I knew I had to scoop it up just because I ain't never seen it before, like in person. And that is the last volume that I was able to pick up for February. Um, you know, college student life, Money's a little bit tight, so I can't splurge out how I would like to, of course. And yes, yes, I know the One Piece box set did drop. I know it dropped. Personally, I had the chance to get it. I just chose not to because I don't have any of the other One Piece volumes. Like, I, I, I wouldn't be able to start from the beginning, you know what I'm saying? I think I'm going to just read it on the app, and then I'll pick up the volumes as I find them, kind of like Hunter x Hunter, um, because... There's people out here who want to genuinely get the One Piece box sets. That like that's their last box set they need to be up to date. And for me to just grab it and not read it would be kind of I feel disrespectful to the people who actually want it. You know what I'm saying? All right. And for those of y'all who stuck to the end, um, I just do want to say at the time of recording this video, we have hit over 200 subscribers. That's crazy, bro. But yeah. I don't want the outro to be too long-winded, so I'm gonna just do this rapid fire really quick. Um, pop collection video coming soon, gaming videos coming soon. Um, what else? I don't know what else. Just whatever. If y'all have any ideas, let me know. Um, I'll think about it, and they might, you know, come to fruition, become videos. You know what I'm saying? So if you want to see me do a certain thing or make a certain type of content that you want to see let me know so that way you can see it you know what i'm saying um but other than that i just want to say i appreciate y'all i love y'all you guys stay safe out there you know what i'm saying yeah that's all i have to say uh i'll see y'all around man take take it easy uh i'll see y'all in the next vid deuce